Hey, what's up and welcome. This is Matthew Msingati, the designer and developer, the greatest of all time. I am from South Africa. Let's continue with our Shared CN Masterclass. And now we are doing the avatar. I must say, I think this is going to be the most uh, simplest tutorial. And I didn't really find a way that I can add more value on this component. This component is just plain simple okay straight to the point so what i'm going to do i'm just going to show you how to use it and that will be it so if you want maybe you don't know what an avatar is an avatar is just um a circle with an image which is usually it's uh, a user profile and that's about it so let's quickly uh install the avatar using npm i already got um a next.js application here so i'm just going to install this and then as it's installing, it will show up on shared CN component UI here. Okay, after showing up here, we are going to create, as you can see here, is it we are going to create our own avatar here on this folder. Okay, components. Um, I apologize about that. Where is my shared CN? Okay, this one. Okay, these are my own shared CN um, components. Okay, so let's just type here my avatar okay dot tsx all right and then press enter okay and then let's go back to the avatar and see okay so after that we just need to import these okay so here we're going to press rfce okay react functional component and inside here we can my apologies about that this is totally wrong okay we need to first import everything here and go back and copy this code here and then from there paste it here as you can see guys this is our avatar and then we need to take this component and display it on our main page as you can see this is the aspect ratio so we are going to display this and then um, on windows i'm just going to press control on my keyboard and press space so that i can import the avatar and then from there let's go to um to our main page and see as you can see guys okay this is the the avatar okay this is the avatar and what we can do we can go to the aspect ratio and just use the same uh image um the reason why we are going to use this image is simply because the url for that image okay has already been um added or uh, to let's say to sheds uh, sorry to next.js my apologies guys okay this url has already been added to next.js so next.js is not going to ask us a lot of things instead of taking an image from a different website so instead of this let's put our own image okay as you can see this is our own image okay i want you to observe what's going on here let's say mt okay this is more like a fallback um Maybe in case this image is still loading or maybe it's null, I think then it will use this. And that's about it, guys. Um, Let's go back here and test. As you can see, guys, okay, let's put enter. As you can see, it shows empty and then it shows this, okay? Um, Let's say um, as an added bonus, you might want this to be a little bit bigger. The first thing that we need to do, let's check this avatar. Does it have a prop of size, okay? Does it have a prop of size? It looks like there is no prop of size. So let's see. Um, do we have any class name that we can put here? It looks like we have. So let's just check the width to be 20 and the height to be 20. Let's see what will happen. And then I'm just uh, trying to show you how you can change the width and height. Okay. As you can see, guys, you can also uh change the width and height guys i'm not going to make this tutorial longer unnecessarily that's about it i am matthew singati i am a designer and at the same time i'm a developer if you might want to learn a specific skill without watching long udemy tutorials that only teaches you um a little thing okay i have got a 10 hour coaching course where i solve your specific problem if you might be interested just click on the discovery call give me your name and your email you will have a one hour free discovery call with me so that you can see if i can take you somewhere and then i've got a buy me a coffee here if you might like to support the channel please come here 
and support the channel i've got another channel which is coded ui let's see is it here not really let me just type here coded ui where i teach people how to um create awesome user interfaces and these interfaces i code them here on coded design as you can see guys so please come and support this channel thank you so much see you on the next one